Good day everyone, you're watching Rate You Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about um, the quick fix in case if you're not able to open Outlook uh, after installing a Windows update, which is a KB456036. Now, after installing the update, Outlook won't start and it, uh, and in case if it opens, it opens for the um, profile name and it disappears. And even if you go ahead and check in the task manager, you would not see the outlook.exe running in the task manager. Now, there is a quick, easy, simple fix which you need to follow. All you have to do is you will have to roll back uh, the uh, update. Now, in order to do that, what you will have to do is you will have to click on the search. In the search, go ahead and type Windows PowerShell. Once you open Windows PowerShell, uh, go ahead and right click on the uh, top of the bar and click on edit and click on paste You can paste this command and hit enter on your screen. Now what this will do is this will go ahead and um, Roll back your office update to the older version now After you have done that there is like it is there are likely chances that you know you, uh, This update might get installed on the computer now before uh, after running this command you can go ahead and try opening outlook and you should be able to out open outlook and after rolling back the update what you will have to do is i would suggest you to go ahead and uh, disable the windows update for at least uh, seven days until you have uh, the latest updates uh, available or fix available for to disable the windows update for uh, seven or uh, 28 days what you can do is you can do a right click on the Windows icon, go to settings. Once you're on the settings page, you will have to go to Windows and security. Under Windows and security, you can go ahead and uh, check the box which says pause updates for seven days. So what this will do is this will go ahead and uh, pause the updates for at least seven more days and um, so that until you have the updates available you will not be able to uh, windows up windows will not be updating on the computer in case if you want to update it uh, pause the update for a few more days uh, on the same window what you can do is you can go to advanced option and you can select the option under the pause updates you can select the option which says pause until and you can give the maximum date that is um, in my case I'm going to give it till August 21 2020 so this is how you can get, uh, go ahead and avoid this problem i'm sure microsoft would go ahead and release a quick fix or a patch for it to uh, avoid further issues with the outlook i hope this video was helpful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day